Martins and here we are in my home studio near Fremantle in Western Australia. I started painting uh, in around 2009. I decided to take a year away from the paid work that I had been doing to find in myself what it was that I wanted to do, whatever made me feel happy, whatever felt joyful inside. As soon as I started painting, it was kind of like, wow, how could I have not known that, that I loved this so much? People often ask uh, what the process is that I go through. Um, so starting straight from a blank canvas, uh, I'll just randomly choose paints, that the colours that will jump out at me. Not directing it very much in the first few layers, basically going back to kindergarten, kind of, you know, but without the teacher there, <laughs> making judgments, and just uh, really having a lot of fun filling the canvas with colour and images. And then as those layers start to develop really richly, there often is images that come out that I have the impulse to develop further or sometimes not. Sometimes I'll leave the canvas as an abstract canvas. I use my hands a lot and uh, I really like to feel the paint. Yeah, it's just that textural experience. essential oils which change how I'm feeling and how I'm responding to the canvas. Sometimes I put that in my spray bottle. Every day is a surprise and I often wake up with colours going off in my head and sometimes when I paint the prayer flags that I paint I'll just be given the prayer. It's kind of like when you're writing songs or poetry. It's things just start flowing through. The more you kind of allow that to happen the easier it becomes. It's an intuitive thing of just following um, where my eye falls. Um, there's like an impulse that just arises in me to just put the colour somewhere in a certain way. I'll often turn the canvases around, sometimes a few different times before I actually settle on which direction the canvas is going to stay in. Every canvas is completely different and I think that that's what excites me. And I like being surprised, I like that rush um, that comes with that feeling that's, that it's come through me rather than from me. It feels like a very spiritual experience for me.